<coughs> hey everybody, this is the striker. Back with more human evolution. <coughs> okay, so shadows. Okay. Squeeze a little little bit more power out of the R9 290X to uh put the shadows on normal instead of soft. <coughs> Hmm. <clears throat> oh, I love this game. I really love this game. It's a sh it's a shame this it's a shame this game is going to end soon. Uh. <clears throat> Don't give in to them. At least, I've, at least I've cut my nails, so I don't have to worry about. Uh, so I don't have to slouch my fingers and worry about. And I don't. And I also don't have to worry about scratching the keys because of that. <clears throat> hmm. Okay. Actually, um, the next time I, uh, next time I play this game, I'll, uh, I think I'll, uh, stay away from the shotguns and stay on to the, stay with the rifles, maybe. <laughs> ah, what's with these crates in the world? Move. Oh, there we go. It goes up. We're working as fast as we can. This pressure you're putting on us doesn't help. Me. <clears throat> Eric, nice to see you again. What? What do you want? I told you people not to barge in here. Wasn't the new biochip design enough? <clears throat> Doctor Cars, I'm here to get you out. Jensen, from Sarif? But we were told we'd been. Written off. Not exactly. Listen, Jensen. They forced me to work for them. I didn't want to create the new biochip, especially since it was based on Sarif's research, but they didn't give me a choice. No one doubts your loyalty, Dr. Koss. Do you know what they plan to do with this new biochip? I'm not sure. They said something about having Tai Young Medical produce it and distribute it through Lim, but I, I can't be sure. I know, and I'm here to bring you all back. But to reach Megan, I need you, Colvin, and Faraday to stage lab accidents as a distraction, simultaneously. Isn't that a little risky? Besides, how will we coordinate these accidents? Uh, it's impossible. Maybe not. But it's that or staying here and eventually ending up like Dr. Sevchenko. They killed him, didn't they? He, he kept provoking them, coming up with these wild escape plans. The... Try to keep us apart as much as possible now. All right, Mr. Jensen. I'm with you. What's our next move? We need to disable their GPL tracker. I know Dr. Sevchenko was working on something. Yes, a, a virus program. We all thought it was too risky considering we had nowhere to go. But I don't have it. You'd better check with Mia or Declan. <clears throat> Dr. Koss. The bioship you mentioned was based on Sarif studies? Yes, I believe so. Uh, at first I thought it was merely convergent research, but uh, I've worked with Dr. Reed long enough to recognize her handiwork. Uh, besides, I had been working on something similar back in Detroit. And your knowledge of it made you invaluable here? At least to a certain extent. Uh, it probably helped us all stay alive. But now with Dr. Shevchenko, I guess we've all become expendable. Except for Dr. Reed, I suppose. Why do you say that? 
it's more of a general feeling, I guess. Back in Detroit, uh, we all realized that we were on the verge of something groundbreaking. And here, well, everyone seems to view her research as crucial in some way. That might explain why she's being held in a secured area. Possibly. I'm just glad we're going home. It's kind of hard to believe. Declan, right. Dr. Cost, do you have any idea where they're keeping him? I, I might. I, I overheard some of the guards. I, I think he might be working in the basement of the biomech labs. But I, I'm not sure. Sit tight, Dr. Cost. When you feel a vibration from your GPL, set off that distraction. That'll be the signal. I will. Good luck, Mr. Jensen. And hurry. Right now, I'll speak with Faraday. And he is in the other building. Sod it. Don't really care anyway. Actually, how? How the bloody hell is this sky bridge? Skywalk. Ah, oh, money. Yeah, it's a shame this series is going to end soon because I'm pretty sure I'm close to the end. I've not. Um. I've I've played the original before. On PS3, I know how it ends. Oh yeah! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Wow! Holy shit! Uh. You know what? Uh, sorry, rifle, but rifle, but you're gone. You're gone, rifle. No, 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 no. Right. Dealing with possible terminators here. That guy's big enough to be one. And probably strong enough to be one too. Actually no, he's bit he's he's more than big enough. In fact in terms of size, he's bigger. But is he as strong? Get me with that. You're not gonna get me. I've got dermal on. Hostile on the run. Come on. You might hear you, cockhead. I 
want to see how this new revolver fares. Booster. So I can take that bolt. Yep, I got it. <clears throat> yep, dermal armor. I'm not sure why I spend. I might spend it on sprint enhancement. Maybe a, maybe a battery, an extra battery. A typhoon ammo. Does he have a does he have a typhoon system built in? If he does, why did he use it? EMP grenade, I'll keep that. No. I'm gonna have. That's just another way of sneaking around. Uh, I haven't. <clears throat> oh, is it lift? Sod it! I don't care about the lift. Looking around for some high post stims. Uh, painkillers. Kill that pain. Besides, they're probably hooked up to IVs anyway. Hello. Adam? Adam Jensen? Good grief, lad. What the blaze has happened to you? I made the mistake of surviving. I'm here to get you out, Dr. Faraday. I told the silly that Seraph wouldn't stop looking. Sevchenko's dead, Dr. Faraday. I'm sorry. I figured as much. 
One day he was just gone and they wouldn't say why. We were all afraid, so we just kept to the work. They forced me to create a signal pattern that could broadcast software upgrades directly into a person's implanted circuitry. Upgrades? That do what? Whatever instructions have been encoded into them. They said it was to improve efficiency at clinics, but that wouldn't be the only application. Far from it. I see. Dr. Faraday, we need to free Megan from the isolation zone. I've got a plan to distract the guards. Three lab accidents. I like your style, son. And it just might work if you can get Nia and Eric to agree. But timing them to occur at once, that will be the trick. I'll worry about the timing. For now, sit tight and wait <clears throat> for my signal. There's one thing you're forgetting, lad. They can track our GPL signals. I know. But I'm hoping you might have the solution to that problem. Sevchenko's viral program. Of course! I shouldn't have underestimated you. Vasily gave it to me before he disappeared. Here you are. Upload it onto the central security computer. It will scramble their scanners. I would have done it myself, but <clears throat> I'm just a scientist. Don't sell yourself short, Doc. <clears throat> Any idea who's behind this, Doc? The kidnapping, the facility? Not really. Remarkable, considering I've been here six months. You would have thought someone would let something slip. But if it doesn't have to do with the research, you don't get a word out of them. Sounds like the guards are well trained. But what kind of threats were needed to stop the other researchers from talking? Well, there were threats early on just to get us to work. Of course, Vasily saw right through that. Kept saying they needed us. I suppose in his case, the risk outstripped the return at some point. Damn them. Dr. Sevchenko probably knew the risks and accepted them. That he did. Go on, lad. Let's put this plan of yours into action. It's time to teach these wankers a lesson. Oh, yes. Tell me, where do I find this security terminal? Vasily told me there's a tunnel leading to it, near the back of the compound, I believe. But I'm afraid you'll have to explore a bit to be sure. Once I upload the virus, it'll be time to act. I'll signal you. A vibration in your GPL. Be ready. Understood, lad. But do be careful. Gas doesn't concern me right now. I could go pretty much anywhere. I can land from any distance. I can jump further height. Let's get all the holes in the walls. Be outside for that to work. The WHO, World Health Organization. Ah, blah, blah. junk. Money. 
Well, there's this, there's this money actually could it be any use. Four of these. Oh yeah, I could easily hack this. Pritchard, are you still tracking the scientists? Of course. Simulate feedback along that route. Make it strong enough to vibrate their implants. They have to feel it. A signal, eh? Not bad, Jensen. I'm sending it now. Uh-uh-uh-uh-ha-ha. Uh, 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 uh. faster. That's better. It's a good thing I've got EMP mines. I think I'll need them. Especially to disable augmentations. And machines alike. So I remember. So this time I did not. I played this on the Your original. Your tenacity, Adam Jensen, is really quite irritating. <clears throat> We'd like you to stop now. I'm afraid I can't, so You see, I figured it out. I know what you and your conspiracy <laughs> buddies are planning. <clears throat> Do you? How clever! A new biochip, a software upgrade that limits what augmentations can do. You're creating a kill switch. You kidnap Megan Reed's team to do it, and you're seizing control of the market to ensure it gets distributed. All because you're afraid of people like me. Augmented people, with the power to resist you. No one's afraid of you, Mr. Jensen. All your blundering around and childish interference hasn't stopped a thing. Tell me, have you been to a limb clinic lately? <laughs> Let me guess. That was supposed to shut me down, right? Leave me broken and begging. The Orgs were recalled. You should be offline! <laughs> Women never fail to underestimate men. You should have stayed dead, Jensen. It's a good thing I didn't take that chip. It's a good thing I didn't get get the tie on the medical chip this time. I did that on the original. You have no idea what it is you're chasing, do you? Ay 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 ay. Aha. Uh. Help 
<laughs> Is it fear, Jensen? Knowing you'll die without fun. Look at you, jumping at shadows like a scared child. Come on. Come on, big boy. Goodbye, oh. my friend. Oh, that's... Uh, I best. Oh, 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 oh. Behind you, Jensen. That business in Detroit with the You're not gonna get me with that plasma rifle. I thought you would be more formidable than this. Ah oh! Not plasma. Bad plasma. Good man. I should have been... There we go. <coughs> Finish it. Not until you tell me where Megan is. <clears throat> You've lost her, Jensen. Men like us, we never get back the things we love. <sighs> okay. I'll be taking that plasma rifle. Thank you very much. Oh, yes. I've been waiting for this. Yes. Up, oh, give me that. There we go. Give me that plasma. Okay, um, that didn't go well. Oh yeah, I can't wait to use this plasma rifle, even though I've used it before. Actually, let's examine this. <clears throat> High NRG plasma lance. <clears throat> it doesn't take silences, obviously, because it fires plasma. It takes a target seeking system, it takes a laser sight, has a lot of damage. High damage, it's long range. A next generation weapon. Plasma lance is perhaps the most advanced battlefield weapon of the 2020s. A high-tech firearm that projects a bolt or pulse of superheated plasma down an iron ice path towards its target. It can deliver heavy damage against medium and heavily armoured targets, enough to actually disintegrate some of them, but only at, at limited range and at a slow rate of fire. Sustained operation can also result in temporary shutdown due to overheating, because it's plasma and it gets very hot. The weapon supports all standard grades as well as... Special internal coolant enhancement ice package. It can prevent it from overheat. It can prevent it from overheating during sustained fire. Sustained fire. It's also compatible with laser targeting systems. I'm not. I'm not sure where I'd get an ice package from. I'm going to it here. <clears throat> 